Sun is a star around which Earth and the other components of the solar system revolve. It is the dominant body of the system, constituting more than 99% of its entire mass. The Sun is the source of an enormous amount of energy, a portion of which provides Earth with the light and heat necessary to support life. The radius of the Sun, R, is 109 times that of Earth, but its distance from Earth is 215 R, so it subtends an angle of only half a degree in the sky, roughly the same as that of the Moon. The mass of the Sun is 743 times the total mass of all the planets in the solar system and 330,000 times that of Earth. While the temperature of the Sun drops from 15 million K at the center to 5,800 K at the photosphere, the Sun has been shining for 4, 6 billion years. Considerable hydrogen has been converted to helium in the core, where the burning is most rapid. The helium remains there, where it absorbs radiation more readily than hydrogen. This raises the central temperature and increases the brightness. The sun color is white, when viewed from space or when the sun is high in the sky. When measuring all the photons emitted, the sun is actually emitting more photons in the green portion of the spectrum than any other. When the sun is low in the sky, atmospheric scattering renders the sun yellow, red, orange, or magenta. Despite its typical whiteness, most people mentally picture the sun as yellow. The reasons for this are the subject of debate. Now the question is an NBSP, does sunlight weigh anything? The answer is, yes. Sun's light, composed of photons reaching the Earth, definitely has equivalent mass. That's the reason the area covered in shadow weighs less than the area being pushed by light. Especially, the sunlight emitted in a day would be around 3. 7 into 10 to the power 24 kilograms. If you collect all the sunlight in a perfect mirror box, the mass of the box would increase by that amount because of the photon energy. Furthermore, freely streaming mass less protons are deflected by gravitational fields. Did you know, on a sunny day, Chicago weighs 140 kilograms more, simply because sunlight is falling on it. 